Howdy, boys, ghosts, cats, and squirrels. So close to those here. Welcome to the YouTube channel. Welcome back. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Hopefully you had a wonderful weekend to all the mothers out there. Shout out to you. I hope you all got your mom some flowers. Did some chores around her house. You know how that goes. But you know what day it is? A Monday. But it's a day to check out more beatboxing. And I'm really amped up to be checking this one out. It's Codfish's showcase for this Beat Fest 2022 that was in Japan. We saw D-Lo's showcase. And it's just always fun to watch beatboxers do their routines live in an uncontrolled environment where anything can happen. When we heard D-Lo's, he did so many different versions of beats that we knew and then brought out some new originals for the stage. It's always fun to hear the raw, unfiltered, uncut version of beatboxers songs and i think it's safe to say that codfish is uh is back he's starting to release more songs and a lot of the songs have just been studio versions so maybe maybe we'll hear some snippets of them in the live format so ladies and gentlemen if you're ready to check out a live codfish out in the wild drop the l hit the bell let's check it out what's he got cooking also this intro is one of my favorites in recent memory for beatbox channels. You ever oh, had a dream he's spinning around. somehow maybe you could do anything? You could do anything. You, you wish that you could. We're already you, you tried you could. You, you dream that you could. You, you think that you could. You, you dream that you could. You, you think that you could. I mean, Dilo's you, there. You dream that you, you think he'll come you, out? You, you try to you could. You, you push you up, could. You, you party up, could. You, you bring you up, could. You, you think that you could. You tap and push you up, could. You could do anything. I wish we had a better mic on the audience, so I want to hear them clapping. <laughs> You could do anything. Yo, him and Wing would be a good collaborators. I got that same type of mid-tempo. Step up to the base. Hit you with that I do like when he gets into his like break beat. Hit you with that It's almost like like twang or funk. Whatever that genre is, you know what it is. Funk? Where they're like walking in slow motion. Giga Chad like. The lighting is Mm-hmm. 
I feel like his routines are almost like spiritual, like therapeutic. Just meditating. Like you know, the crowd is getting like, whoa! I want to hear that. passed out and on the stage and they would need medical attention but there was no pause he just kept that going the whole way he just has those sets that you get wrapped up in and you're just kind of jamming it's just a it's like a jam set i feel like he really has done a good job as far as building that into his brand and even now with reaps one you see his routines you see his sets live I feel like he builds a good immersive environment with beatboxing and the sounds and the way he's just building routines and transitioning to a guy who's just doing like some dubstep beatboxing on a couch to just making across the whole spectrum with beatboxing art and with codfish i feel like you can say something similar where he just was a dude playing video games beatboxing and he decided to take that leap into the competitive scene compete became champion and now i feel like he's gone through this artistic transition where he doesn't have to prove himself anymore he's built his beatbox group the tribe and his own brand of beatboxing where people will come to watch and just see him jam and just enjoy it because he's enjoying himself it's so beautiful i love it but ladies and gentlemen what did you think of this codfish sesh i've been loving everything i've been watching from beat x fes i'm seeing a sorrow connie clip right in front of me and i want to watch it so stay tuned for some more and let me know of videos to check out for the future have a wonderful rest of your week peace out shake and